in this tutorial we will be creating door and windows so suppose we want to create this window we know that the size of this window is 2 by 1 meter so at first we we will have to change the plane on which plane we want to work if you choose the ACI symmetric then this plane is right right this plane is front so I want to create on this plane so I will change my UCS to right plane so click here on right and here you can view that Z is horizontal and XY is vertical and if you don't want this grid you can make it off from here grid display now using rectangle I can create a rectangle rectangle click outside give the first point then click on dimension give the length of 2 and height of 1 and click then zoom it then offset offset by 0 0.05 0 0.05 enter click the rectangle click inside then select line command create a line from midpoint to midpoint enter to come out then offset this line offset by 0 0.025 on either side first on right side suppose then on left side enter then erase the middle line for that you can give E enter select the line to erase enter then trim this portion for that here is the trim then select these two line as a cutting edge press enter and remove the unwanted object press enter to come out then press full it take the press full command go inside the window go on the frame so take it on one corner and give the direction so we want to go inside by 0 0.05 enter enter so this window frame is created we want to create a glass so for that again take the rectangle command zoom below here and click on the midpoint and click on the opposite midpoint of the same frame now this rectangle is created convert it into region click on this draw and take the region command and click on this rectangle and press enter so in this way this plane will be created which will act as a glass then move this or copy copy so you have to copy the glass and the frame so click on the glass and the frame then enter then suppose I will take this as a base point this midpoint then make ortho of F8 zoom here so I want it inside so just orbit it slightly by holding down the shift and scroll and dragging the mouse and click on this midpoint so here it has been placed and other we want to place here so click on this midpoint press escape to come out so in this way this window has been properly placed so same way you can we, we will erase this window enter so same way you can create this window on the front plane so from here you have to choose the front plane and same procedure you have to repeat then next will be to create the door suppose I want to create this door here this door 0.9 by 2 meter height so for that again this door will be on the right plane so we will take from your right then same then we will create one rectangle rectangle give first point then click on dimension the length will be 0.9 and height will be 2 click then zoom it offset by 100.1 inside click the door click inside then press enter then again take the line command take the midpoint to midpoint enter then offset it by 100 on either side again offset 
point one is already there. Press enter. Select object. Take your cursor up and click. Again select the object. Take your cursor down and click enter. Then erase this line. E enter. Select enter. Then to trim you can also use the TR as a shortcut. Press enter. Select these two cutting edges. Press enter and remove these two lines. Press enter. Then again press pull it. Press pull. Take your cursor in the corner. Take it inside and give the depth of 0.05 50 mm. Then press enter. Again take inside rectangle. Give the depth of 0.05. Enter. Then again below rectangle 0.05. Now I want we want to grooves. Now this is actually for this room. So on the inner side I want to keep it plain and from outside I want to create the grooves. So what I will do? I will orbit it. Here is the door. And then I will click inside and give the depth of 0.025. Enter. Again below. Select there, give the depth of 0.025. Enter. So, in this way, this door is created. Then, if you want, you can give different color for inner portion. You can give different color for inner portion. Press escape, double click, give the color. Escape. Then you uh, now these are the three objects, different objects. So we can combine it by using solid union command, or you can keep it as it is so that we can apply different material for it. So then we can move it, move, select object, enter, then select this suppose midpoint, and give the point where you want to suppose I want to keep it from so you can view it from below zoom there and place there so in this way this door has been placed properly so same size of doors are here also and here also so we can copy the those doors so just use copy select object so I don't want this wall so just hold down shift and click on it enter then I will take this midpoint and again I will orbit and see it from the bottom and here I want to place it at the mid of this press escape to come out so in this way you can place door so from this door from these doors Suppose I want to create this door also, which is of 1 meter length. Using this door only, I want to create it. So, at first, I will have to rotate it. So, I will just copy it, copy, select object, enter base point, give the second point, take it outside, escape to come out, erase this. Then to rotate it, select it and click on this 3D rotate. Now I want to rotate as per blue circle, so click on this blue circle. Okay, to make it horizontal, take it on the front side and click there. Press escape. Now the size of this door is lesser, so I want to increase the size. So for that I can use the press pull command. So just use press pull. Click on this surface. So zoom it properly. Now once it highlighted click there. Give the direction. And I will increase here by suppose 0 0.05. 50 on this side. And 50 on that side. Click on this side. And increase by 0 0.05. So in this way this one meter door is created. So I can move it or copy it.
copy select object enter take this suppose midpoint and put it here orbit it see it from the bottom zoom and place there same will be here also same this way this other direction doors are also created so in this way you can create the again I will erase this this isometric so in this way you can create you can give other color to glass also just double click on, on it and select the color escape so in this way we can create door and window so we will stop here thank you